you weren't old enough. 14, you weren't old enough to bring up a baby on your own. It would ruin your whole life. <sighs> yeah, well, like you said, it's not in great shape anyway, is it? You did the right thing. You gave the baby away. You gave it a proper home. Oh, simple. It's that simple, is it? Do you know what it's like to give away your own flesh and blood, hey? Hand her over, my little girl, to strangers, complete strangers. Then why did you do it? Because you made me. You made me. Did I? Did I hold the pen? Force you to sign, did I? No. no it was your choice. But you told me it was the right thing to do. You told me that if I did it, everything would be okay. You promised me everything would be okay between me and you. No more fighting, no tears. Then after she'd gone, nothing. I got nothing from you. She turned around, you walked away, you left me to shrivel up and die. It's so easy to blame somebody else, Ronnie. Why don't you just face it? You made a choice, a bad choice. <sighs> I was a kid. I was a teenager. What did I know? You knew how to break your father's heart. <gasps> Do you think I've forgotten what it was like when you were little? My sweet little blonde-haired angel chasing me around the garden, bright as a button. Your smile was like having the sun shine right at you. The pair of you. My little golden girls. As soon as you hit 13, everything changed. One minute I've got a daughter that I adore, I dote on, who dotes on me. Next thing she's answering me back, lying. Turning against the one person who tried to do everything for her. Just because I wasn't doing exactly what you said for the first time in my life. Do you know what it's like being a parent, do you? Hey? You put all your hope, all your love into this little thing, hey? You do anything for them. And then to watch this child, this little person who felt like a part of yourself, become something separate. And then, without the slightest regard for your feelings, shine that light on somebody else? That's normal, isn't it? Isn't that normal? That's growing up. Selfish, callous indifference! It's not normal! Undermining me at every turn! As soon as I was old enough, have a mind of my own, you couldn't stand it. Mind of your own? Flipping on your back for some spotty oi, getting pregnant? Yeah, great choice. Smart move. I made a mistake. I didn't know what I was doing. But instead of loving me, instead of helping me through it, you used it against me. Do you know all of this? Roxy's pregnancy, it brought it all back. The, uh, the mood swings. The morning sickness. Do you want to know what I did? I called the adoption register. I called them because I wanted to know where she was. I wanted to know who'd taken her. Do you know what? They couldn't tell me a thing. I just sat there and I cried. No, I sat there and I looked at this. Look. There she is. That's my baby, Amy. And she's gone. I don't know where she is. I don't know anything about her. I don't know if she's happy, but I do know one thing. She should be here with me, her mum.